Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? I've always been impressed with Lautaro Martinez, Peter. We all know how good a finisher he is. But he's proved himself to be a more than reasonable outlet. If needed, he can play with his back to goal and be one that brings everyone else into play. And uh, he's a significant influence. Hard to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. And that gets things running. Montiel. Messi. Lovely bit of skill. Some terrific running on the ball there. Those efforts are not going unappreciated. He's left his man, purring through, can he put it away? Forwards and with intent, Garnacho. he is through here. And it's Messi. Oh, that's a foul, free kick's been given. And it's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. Now it's Martinez. Played out towards the right wing. Cross into the box. Yeah, I think if that can be repeated, um, there's a good chance of a goal. Johnston. It's been a pretty frantic start, a lot of front foot pressing. McAllister. Romero. I wonder what you've seen, Jim, over the early moments of the game. Well, I think both teams probably feel it's, it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. Solid defending, refused to be out-muscled. Oh, he's enjoyed that. He evidently loves the contest. Gently done. David. Oh, some tackle that. DePaul. Gustacchio. Argentina are still to register a shot on target. As a matter of fact, a shot of any type. Could move up a gear here. Knocks it out wide. Can he latch on to this? Davis. Johnston, Buchanan, Larin, Acuna, and that is played back to front. No, that's been intercepted. Ustakio. Davis fiddles it through Hoylert and that's a goal kick and he cuts out the supply Gustacchio, shifted upfield.
And it's Messi. Now it's Martinez. Ustakio. Buchanan. Oh, what a ball! Well, that's been cut out, well played. Passing is crisp and sharp. Acuna. Move forward and quickly so. Davis. And it's Hoylet. Now Ustakio. Larin. Pinches it off him. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. Messi proves just a little bit too strong. Larin spread out to the left. Larin. And we've reached half time. Well, there it is, half time. Not a bad watch by any means. And the efforts of both sides have been good, but neither have been able to penetrate. And so we reach the break, and the game remains goalless. Some first-half thoughts? It's been a pretty abject performance. No efforts at goal. I'm struggling to remember the last time we had that. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Nil-nil then, and we're back on the way. That's good running with the ball. Johnston. Buchanan. Larin. Played out to the right. Acuna. Acuna. A oh, lovely feed, he is such a good mover. Well oh, read, nice interception. Larin. Larin. Davis. And here's Hoylert. Oh, we're still waiting for a goal to report here. Hoylert. Acuna with the clearance. Nicked it back promptly. Martinez. De Paul. Now it's Messi. De Paul! And the follow-up! No mistake! He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Well, that's not the best attempt by the keeper, and he's just paid the ultimate price, hasn't he? Argentina take the lead, 1-0. Look, you can't deny that it's a blow, but this game is far from unsalvageable. Ustakio. Threads one in. Can he get onto this?
De Paul. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, I'm inclined to feel that if I was in that dugout, I'd want the players to, to get on the front foot and grab another. Just try to, to make this one safe. In the end, they found themselves penned in, nowhere to go. Martinez. Messi. Montiel. No surprise at all that this is the guy who's had such a positive impact. Well, having that sort of player in your side is reassuring because the rest of the team knows he can make his influence count at any stage. It's simply part of his package. When he really wants to, this fella scores. Acuna. And the two sides separated by the game's only breakthrough moment to this point. 1-0 the score. For De Paul. Now it's Martinez. And Martinez! And that would have won it. Martinez has reacted in utter shock here. For him, the keeper has pulled off the impossible. Final checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. The cannon. Hoylet might just make this. Davis. Toilets in acres of space out wide. Climbs up big! It's in! Do not write them off! Back they come! Martinez, and he's only too grateful to capitalise on the keeper's misfortune. Well, they say all goalkeepers are crazy, and after that, maybe there's some truth in it. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Canada surely know by now that they've put so much work into producing the equaliser that they'll battle on for a winner. You know, it's, it's all one-way traffic for them now, and they simply have to capitalise on it. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Well, they shouldn't be dawdling at this stage. They need to get the ball in the mixer and quickly. Exciting looking ball, that. Nice interception. His positioning was spot on. And it's messy. Oh, that's nice. De Paul. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick.
still inseparable. We have penalties. Well, both managers would have preferred not to go this far, but here we are. It's about nerve control now.